here's an example of one. I removed one channel flake uh, along the edge and then another one which extended up to the middle of the uh, uh, point preform. And I uh, repeated uh, some uh, same process on the other side. And what I done was just uh, used a uh, small pressure flaker and applied pressure towards the tip. I uh, have here some preformed. These are way in uh, excess uh, of uh, Folsom preformed, but it shows the type of uh, channel flakes that one can remove with pressure, direct hand pressure, if you have the right material and the right skills. Folsom points are generally uh, uh, quite thin, uh, three to uh, uh, four and a half uh, millimeters thick. It's a risky uh, process when you get uh, to the uh, Folsom stage. And uh, there are a lot of uh, failures, uh, point failures. Sometimes you have uh, the first channel flake terminated short here on this. And the uh, second one uh, removed, uh, went to the distal end and removed part of the distal end. And all that's required on something like this is to uh, retouch a point and uh, trim the uh, distal, the uh, lateral edges. Here's another, uh, a fulsome point that I uh, re removed the first channel uh, flake, uh, terminated short. Second one took off a good portion of the uh, distal uh, end of the preform, but it's uh, within the thickness of fulsome. I would guess this is about three and a half millimeters thick. And uh, this is still a usable point. I do have some preforms here that I made uh, off. And notice the uh, uh, distal end is uh, square to rounded off. The uh, final trimming will be, uh, uh, well, process will be trimming the uh, point.